Great. What up, y'all boys? It's your boy Philly back at it again. Week one of the NFL season. And we got a whole slate of 16 games. I don't even know, bro. We got a bunch of games, though. But anyways, um, I ain't doing this video alone. Though. I'm here with my boy, T. Yo. And I'm here with my boy, B. Yo. All right, let's go, bro. All right, so we ain't even going to do no more intro. Let's go ahead and get straight into it. We got the Lions and Chiefs. Dang. I don't know who's going to win that game, bro, because the Chiefs ain't got Travis Kelsey playing. And even if he do play, that boy hyperextended his knee. What y'all think about that? Chiefs. Wait, is Chris Jones playing? Still... Uh, probably not. Probably not. Really? If Kansas City keep losing, like, their two weapons, it, the team could downgrade. But at the same time, they got that number one weapon on their team, Patrick Mahomes. Exactly. True, true. But and like, then they still had some a few solid weapons like Justin <laughs> Ross. He, Justin Ross been I don't know. Justin Ross been doing good in training camp. Yeah, Justin Ross been doing good in training camp. True. Um, Mark. They still got Marquez on the on, and they got and they got Kadon. Oh, damn, I'm sorry. Cause <laughs> Darius Tony starting week one. I heard. And then Sky Moore ain't bad, but that number, Bo. Sky Moore is not trash. It, it that number is outrageous though. Twenty four is crazy. It's, it's wild. It's wild. Oh shoot! But uh, dang the Lions though. I can't sleep on the Lions for nothing, bro. Bro, we like, cannot got sleep a good on J-Mo, bro. We cannot sleep on J-Mo. Like he ain't playing though. He ain't playing. I don't think he's playing. He got. He's, he's finished his games. Dang. But they still got. They still got good. They still got good weapons. They got Jamar Gibbs. Yeah, you got, you got Montgomery Amara. now. Amara. 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 Yeah. yeah. Like, I mean. I still got a lot of weapons, though. They, they have a rookie title. Yeah, I think they got that. Mm-hmm. And the offensive line, heard, I was, I was, I was, I heard the yeah. offensive line got better on the offseason. Yeah, so, um, they got a – they had drafted uh one one of the known tight ends um, from the 23-3 NFL draft. Laporta, but the defense – but the defense, you got to worry about, too. Yeah, See, yeah they, they got some good on the guy. Not about Aiden Hutchinson, the, the guy. Aiden Hutchinson, uh, they they just picked up um um Garney, CJ Garner Johnson off the free agency. Right, Brian Branch from Alabama too. Right, yeah. So, they got a lot of weapons. So, so I don't know, bro. I can't bet against the Chiefs, but dang, if Travis Kelsey not playing, I don't know who to go with. Both. So, I cannot bet against Mahomes. I'm I just did it in the Super Bowl, so I can't do I can't it. Bet against Mahomes. I'm going. I'm going to go. With I the bet. Chiefs. I mean, you know how many times I bet against Go-on Mahomes, so I'm losing my money. I, I'm, I'm going with I'm going to go with the Chiefs. I'm going with the Chiefs. 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 You say Chiefs? I was yeah, about right. $50 bid against him. I told you how to bid against him. <laughs> I told you how to bid against him in that Eagles game, but that was your fault. All right. Uh, we got the Bengals and Browns. Bro, I told you before. Don't, I told I keep telling people don't sleep on the Browns, bro. Like, I got, look at the Browns. Right, so, look. So, look. I can't. They still got their star corner, um, Denzel Ward, and they got Miles yeah, Garrett. But the rest of the team, I don't, I don't know about that. But they, I see they picked up, um, a free safety from Kansas City. I forgot. His name. I think his, oh, his Warren name is Hill. Yeah, but I, I don't think that's gonna like make a part of their defense though, because he getting old. But um, you can't sleep on that Browns defense. But Bengals, and they got Joe Burrow um playing week one. You know what I'm saying? He he's probably not gonna be fully healthy, but. I can see, I can still see them making plays though with Jamar and T. Wait, one question, y'all boys. The y'all thing think... is about the Browns. They got a good team, but they in a hard division. Like the Steelers, you can't sleep on them. The Ravens, you can't sleep on them. Obviously, the Bengals. All right, though. I look, you think they would be all right? Like really? Overall, the only like, thing I think will hold them back is that John Watson don't come back hundred percent. Yeah, that's that's, that's really the only thing that can hold them back. John Watson playing disability. But we gotta stop pretending like Deshaun Watson is scrub now. Like he had one bad year, and he just he just came back. Like he might have personal stuff, but I don't even. They ain't, when it come to football, anybody yeah. really talking about that? But uh, well, well, what question? Like for real though, like do y'all think that the Bengals rush Joe Burrow injury? Like coming him coming back? I don't know. He they down, really did. I th- they, I have a feeling they, they did. If it's I forgot what injury, what injury he had? It was some kind of leg injury. Like he has a, a calf injury. Calf injury. Yeah, right. the calf injuries ain't no joke, bro. That's just that's what I'm saying. Bro. And then like, like they said it was that same that said it was that same leg he tore his ACL on like his first year. 
Because with calf injuries, bro, if you don't recover the right, right way, that's just going to linger the whole season. Yes, it will. But, uh, like I said, bro, I'm going to go to Bengals bump it. Like, I, I don't mean no disrespect to the Browns, but the Bengals. The only thing I think will hold the Bengals back if they do lose is Joe Burrow not 100%. I mean, I think that's the problem. Yeah, I'm going to go with the Bengals. Come on, Bengals. Right. These next game, these next two might be easy to call. The Texans and the Ravens. Okay. I see. All right. Don't sleep on the Texans now. We know we picked – we know that they picked up um number two overall quarterback, CJ Straw from Ohio State. And, shoot, they got weapons. They got wide receivers out there. They got Nico Collins, veteran wide receiver, um, Robert Woods. Don um, Mitch. Nico Cox. Oh, I already said it. I'm sorry. Um, John Mitchy, um, Tank Dale. Yeah, I'm saying. You know, what I'm saying they got all them players out there. And then they and picked they, up they, they, Dalton Schultz. They, yeah, they picked up Dalton Schultz from the Jordan. He good too. Yeah, and they got a, a decent O line. Nah, they they O line. Sorry, they O line ain't good. Bro. Well, that left side, that only left side is really good. Like Mervyn Thompson, all right, but everybody else just. <laughs> Yeah, good. but um, I got the Ravens thing is, they got the a thing is, though, it shouldn't be a problem because the Ravens pass rush ain't too good either. Yeah, they picked up new head coach, um, D'Amico Ryan's. That um, he was a defensive coordinator for um, San Francisco. Yeah, they he got deep. a job at Houston, so he decided to be head coach for from his former team. All right, who you think, Bo? But I got uh, Ravens for this. Ravens. Yeah, I got the Ravens. The, the Texans got too many problems right now. Take, yeah. Like, they got too many holes on their team. Like, CJ Stroud, he, he might be bad this season, like, at least for this season. Yeah. They O line ain't good. Yeah, they yeah. got a lot of problems. All right. Then she got the Buccaneers and Vikings. Vikings. All the See, way. I'm a no Panthers question. fan, so I'm a, I'm a Panthers fan, but I, I'm obviously going to go with the Vikings because. I have, you know what I'm saying, Justin Jefferson putting up at least 200 yards against them. Oh, no, no. They don't know about that. Carlton Davis. They said Carlton Davis. Carlton Davis. Carlton Davis. Nah, nah. Carlton Davis, he, he look weak. You know what I'm saying? Now, the last time I think they played, like, he locked up Justin Jefferson, but they said the same Justin That was Ricky Justin Jefferson, so they seem to be the same one. But the Vikings, I ain't going to lie. They deep, I think they just because they got, um, what's the name? Brian Flores on their defense. They defense ain't going to be good off the bat. I already know that. But the thing is, I think the Buccaneers gonna make their defense look good because Baker Mayfield, he kind of, you know, actually he been playing yeah. good this preseason. I don't know yet. I don't know. Yet. I ain't gonna say too much yet. He been playing good this preseason. I ain't gonna lie. We can't doubt Baker, but I ain't gonna lie. Baker was meant for the Browns. I'm sorry. Like, you see, he ain't, he's not doing anything with no other team. He was meant for the Browns. He had one bad season before the Browns, and the you know what I'm saying the Browns winning. They want a new quarterback. And yeah, he got a good receiving quarterback. Buccaneers. If he can't play good in receiving quarterback, I don't know what to say, but I'm going to go to Vikings with this one. Vikings. Vikings, everybody. Go. All right. I got this, next, this might be the first one that's actually hard to call. The Panthers and the Falcons, bro. Uh, you know me, me, Panthers fan. But really, I'm, I'm going to go with me. Because you know I'm going, I want us to win. But I, I can see the Falcons beating us though, because they got their star whip, their star offensive weapons. But we got, our, we got, we picked up some for free agency. But we got Ricky quarterback Bryce Young first overall pick. We don't, we we don't know what he can do yet. But we seen it in preseason. But he barely has snaps. So really, I'm just gonna go with us. I only expect you to pick against your team, but. Thing about the Pan- the Panthers, like y'all got a good team. Y'all got an okay team on offense. Y'all defense good. Mm-hmm. Y'all defense good. I don't know how good y'all O line is yet, but yeah, the O line. It's just the O line. That left side is really if our O line, like the left side, is really affecting the more the most. And then the Fal the Falcons got a good offense. I just realized that they got Kyle Pitts, B.J. Robinson, Drake London. You got somebody else I can't name right now. <laughs> J.C. Strapp and Jake London. I forgot who. I don't, know, I don't even know the other person was, but yeah, the, I don't know who to go against in this game. Like I said, because division games go, go the way sometimes. 
I have to go to Panthers. I'm gonna go to Falcons. I'm gonna go to Falcons, but it's the way though. But we seen we seen how Desmond Ritter play. Yeah, Desmond like, Ritter. He played right. he, play, he play all right, but like we don't know how he's gonna do this whole season. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You need if nice he, stuff, if he does if he does trash this whole season, I can see a I can see us sweeping them. But yeah. if he played good, like like cute like top tier QB level, I can see them sweeping us. But if he played decent. We're going to go one and one. Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. Yeah, I think y'all going to split either way, though. I can't see either one sweeping nobody, though. But, but for this yeah. one, Falcons. Okay. Okay. Commanders and the Cardinals. I ain't even going to talk to bad. I'm going to go to Commanders, bro. I'm going to say the Commanders because, you know, the Commanders got that amazing D-line. Is Chase Young playing? Oh, he should be. Okay. I can see the Commanders winning. winning. They got Deron Payne. Josh, John, John, dang, I'm sorry, Jonathan Allen, um, Chase Young, and Martres. Wait, I can see man that D line getting at least um that and the Cardinals O line is terrible, so I'll give that D line at least six plus sacks. They whole team, the whole team in general, not too good. That D line finna starting, do. Jake starting Josh Dobbs at quarterback. And he like played like I think he started like one game so far, and that was last the end of last season. So he ain't even got yeah, a lot the of commanders gonna win that. Yeah, gonna win that I ain't gonna lie, I'm a Giants fan, but but Sam Hell kind of I like Sam Hell a lot. I like Sam Hell. Like he remind me a little bit of uh, I ain't gonna lie, he kind of remind me of what Baker Mayfield should have been, but he gonna be better though, I think. Cause he can move yeah. around the pocket, will be a good pass. He got a good arm too. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going go to Commanders. All right. I think matters. you gonna like this one. Jaguars and Colts. Ah, the one and only Colts. All right, ain't gonna, ain't gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be I'm gonna, I'm gonna be real for a minute. The I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you a reason why. Well, I'll go, go Phil, but I'm gonna tell you a reason why out there. All right, go ahead. You wanna go ahead? Oh, you go ahead. I have to go out there. All right, go ahead. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it a book. The Colts don't got as bad of a team as people think they do. Like they defense. Still uh, got some solid pieces. Are y'all open? It's ain't bad. It just depends on what John the Taylor do. And we don't really know what they yeah. do with it yet. But, but I don't think they got a bad team overall, like people think the they do. The thing is that Jonathan is not playing week one. I can see them beating the mess out of him if Jonathan Taylor is playing. But I can see Anthony Richardson doing plays out there too. Like, you know what I'm saying? He, he going to be that Ricky Cam Newton. I can see it. I can see him being a Ricky Cam Newton. But we got to see how that head coach plays. You know what I'm saying? Since he, he was an offensive coordinator for Jalen Hurts, I feel like he going to do a lot of more running plays like he did for Jalen Hurts when he was an offensive coordinator for the Eagles. So mm-hmm. I can see him playing. I can see Anthony Anthony with, like, two rushing touchdowns. I can see that, too. I'm, I'm going to tell you the reason why. He, if we, if we look at the pre, if we look at the previous seasons from the Jaguars' defense, they've been horrible with the pass rush. They, have been, they haven't been – Great with the pass rush since I don't know when. Since he, they so, had ran y'all new boys. Yeah, like, they, they like no, when there was Saxonville, no like twenty seventeen yeah. was the last time where they had like the most sack, like the most like the best pass rush. We have a J, Josh Allen haven't got no pressure last year on nobody. You had uh, like you have a lot of them. You have Kayvon T- you have uh uh what's his name? Kayvon uh, not Kayvon T- uh Kevion Chase on Ain't getting no pass rush against nobody. Oh, he, he, he bad. He that's that's what Zach ain't against. He bad. He's terrible. He's terrible. Yeah. He's so terrible. like, I and plus they have no corners. Their best corners is Tyson Campbell. Let's be real now. Who who's Tyson? Tyson Campbell? Nice. Tyson Campbell's the best corner. Like I don't see, but okay, you have your system. best corner. You, you having your best corner guarding Michael Pittman. Who are you gonna put on? Who are you gonna put on Alex Pierce? We do, we just not gonna act like Alex Pierce is a it's not a six four freight train. Deep three. Who are you gonna put? Darius who? Darius Williams. That's five. What five ten five nine? What? We gonna put him on there? That's head tops all day. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, the Coles offense got some nice pieces. Like I said, the Pittman, Alex Pierce. Yeah. I like Jelani Woods too. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. but I don't think Jelani be playing week one. I don't you know, think. I, mean, what happened? I don't know. Cole, I don't know. I think it's just something about uh, his ankle or something like that. I don't know. But even if they don't, oh. like, well, Ellie Cox playing, right? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, uh, but the Colts, they have amazing wide receivers. Don't get me wrong. Uh, 
but Alex Pierce needed need to um fix that hands them hand problems. Like exactly. I remember seeing the preseason, Anthony drop a dime, but Alex yeah, didn't right, call it. That 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 throw could not get no more better. But then the Jaguars, bro, they offense. Oh. I don't know. They offense. They offense. Like they added good. pieces. I don't know. That's, that's, the, that's the scary part. They about got it. It's Like the only they thing that decent. scares they me is decent. that. Yeah, it, it, it's decent. It's not the best, but only thing that scares me is uh, Calvin really and the Calvin really gonna be on the outside, and you are gonna have a dangerous Christian Watch Christian Kirk. In the middle, in the slot. So it's kind of like, Ingram. yeah, you got every Ingram. Then you got Zay uh-huh. Jones. Like it's a lot of it's a lot of weapons to worry about on that team. So and then ET. Uh, yeah, then I'm saying you worry about Travis like, ETN too. Like yeah, that's what I'm saying. Lord, I don't even know. I don't think Shaq is even playing the week one. I don't think. And then they got and Trevor Lawrence is a six foot six quarterback, and he can he can be running, but we got. I don't think he. I don't know I don't if he has a do. fumble problem. But he, oh, he does. He, can, he does. He, he did that against us last year. He did that against us last year. We huh? played him uh, with the ball. We punched it right out of his hands. Yeah, he got to fumble around a little bit. He going to fix that. I got to go. He going to fix that, though. Yeah. But uh, for this one, uh, I'm going to have to go to Jaguars. I ain't going to lie. I'm going to have to go to the Jags. For yeah, this one? It will be close, though. It's going to be close, though. It ain't going to be no blowout. I'm I can't see the Colts winning this. But – I I got like Jaguars. They got an amazing amazing offense, but I got close on this one. That defense is suspect for the Jaguars. I feel like off. I feel like because like the defense on Jaguars is not that great. So because people, I don't know why the coach. I don't know if people trying to coach still don't got Shaq. Literally, if he do play, DeForest Buckner, who else? Yeah, you still got you got a health. We got a healthy Grover defense. Stewart, Grover Stewart, nice. Grover Stewart, nice. Then we got Quiddy on the outside. Then we got Samson Ekabon. Ekabon. On the out, on the other outside, so it's kind of like so yeah, we have a pass. Yeah, I got a pass for sure. And then that dude from um, yeah, I just drafted. I forgot what college he went to, but Juju Brent, he's good. Oh, Juju Brent, yeah, 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 yeah. Got you. Yeah, yeah Juju. Yeah, it'll be close. Then we got the Rush. Yeah, it'll be close, close though. Uh, the 49ers and Steelers. All right, I ain't gonna lie. Originally, I went to Steelers because I didn't think Nick Bosa was gonna play, but now I don't know. I got still. I got. I mean, I got. Niners, I got the Forty Niners. <laughs> I got nine. Since Bosa came I back, got I got nine. Oh. If Nick Bosa was, if Nick Bosa wasn't playing, I would have went to Steelers. I got forty yeah, niners because ain't nobody get. Bro. Now, there's here's nobody. The thing look, how old Trent Williams is? There's nobody getting through him. <laughs> yeah. Nobody. Now, here's the thing I, I, don't think, I don't even think TJ Watt can do it. No. This thing I got worried with the forty niners though. I don't. Yeah, I don't know about y'all, but I don't, I don't really believe the raw pretty hype yet, Bo. Who? Like, I can't see Brock. I mean, it's just his weapons he has. Yeah, it is. Brock, it's not Brock. I can't, Brock, I can't see not, nobody winning. It's it just his weapons. His weapons. Like, let's be, his defense, like, let, like, let's be realistic, though. Like, if, if we – even if we go to quarterback out there and throw it to George, the best tight end in the game, one of the best tight ends in the game, one of the best running backs in the game, one of the best receivers in the game, we we can look good on that no, a, a top five – look, look, a top five wide receiver core to – Yes. Um, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and, and, and the best, best defense like, in the NFL, like what? Best, best and one the of the game. best defensive coach in the league. Yeah, so like it's kind of like Trey Lance, if you would if Trey Lance didn't get hurt, I'm pretty sure he would have took him to the um, playoffs too. Exactly. I'm pretty sure if, if Brock Purdy end up getting hurt, which I don't hope happens, Sam Darnold would end up even looking good in that offense. Of course, because he don't I have mean, to for do some reason, I can see I can see Sam Darnold being the, like I can see Sam Darnold. Like doing better than Brock, Brock, dang, Brock Purdy. Yeah, I know. I like it's it. it just it's not it's not the quarterback play. It's the it's like the players that's around them. Like you throw the ball up in the air, they're going to make a play regardless. It's not it don't matter who it is. But I got forty nine. Now the Steelers don't don't. I have forty nine because Kenny Pickett is he gonna get picked off like like he's gonna get picked off. It was O line. Yeah. Ain't got it. Steelers O line improved. And that so O line is crash too. The O line, bro. The O line's gonna get abused. Now, the Steelers got a good receiver. They got though. and they, they picked up Javon, Javon Hargrave, man. Oh yeah, they did pick him up. But the Steelers got a good receiving core. They got some good weapons. They got Pickett, Deontay Johnson. I don't know why I, they got Allen Robinson. Yeah, right, right, but yeah like, I'm sure like forty. Like <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah, he like that like that. And then they got Brown, Najee Harris. He should be good now. I think he come back from injury last season or something like that. No, Najee, I ain't gonna lie. He, he, that is a free train. That is a free train too. I can't. Remember. But the only reason why the Steelers can be easy put against because we don't never know what Mike Tomlin gonna do. Never. I don't think Mike Tomlin had a losing. Mike Tomlin never had a losing season, right? If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he didn't. That's crazy. Yeah. That's insane. Oh, yeah. Like. I got 49ers. 49ers. Yeah, here. yeah 49ers. 49ers. I got 49ers. All right. Next, you got the Titans and the Saints. Ooh, two See, mediocre teams. This is another like tough game. This is tough. That's two, two mediocre fan, But I'm going to go with Titans. I'm going I'm going with Saints. Two, I can't. Quarter, two quarterbacks who are quarterbacks who are But they got, good weapons. they got good weapons in but we're not gonna hear. We're not gonna sit here and act like Derek Carr was the problem for the Raiders, bro. We're just not gonna sit here and act like that. Derek Carr was like when it, like when they went to the playoffs, they was not. But they was not saying nothing about Derek Carr then. He wasn't the problem. But I don't think he was the answer. I think Josh McDaniels Loki was the problem when he was day. Like, like Josh come McDaniels on, now. Not- like now he's behind. Now, well, hopefully, Slant Boy can be, you know, healthy. But I don't really I think that. If he's not healthy, then they're they're not he, going. He's getting no. traded. He's getting traded. He either getting traded or could if you're not know, healthy this season. Yeah. It's, it's if they more. keep him a next season, I don't know what to say. That man will be old. He's old. My nah, he's old. Only a one hit wonder. He's going. He's a one hit wonder. <laughs> now they defense. The Saints defense are all right. I don't know if they still you know elite as they used that to. That defense looking getting old. Yeah, it is. Aaron yeah, Gordon, bad, almost forty. Yes, yeah, Marshawn Lattimore. He's still like in his early. In his they got the Mario, the da- Mario Davis getting old. Shoot, um, Cameron yeah. Jordan is for sure old. Yeah, Marshawn Lattimore, twenty seven. He's still good. Yeah, we're still getting old for a yeah, but he keep getting he keep getting suspended and injured. He ain't gonna be able to play good like that no more. Yeah, they do he got a good young. He always getting in fights with Mike Evans. Now they do got a corner for Tennessee. They dropped on Ronte Taylor. He was good last season. I, ain't even, I was just looking at it a couple of weeks ago. He good. A lot of people yeah, yeah. now. He might break out. Who else? Who else I miss? Now they, they got good receivers still aside from that. Chris Olave. He good. I forgot how many yards he had last season. Like a thousand and something. I know he had a thousand. Who else? Alvin Kamara. I don't think Alvin Kamara played week one, is he? Uh, as, as, yeah, 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 yeah. They say he's healthy. Oh, let me check. Let me make sure he's tripping. If I'm not mistaken. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. He got suspended. He got suspended. He got suspended. So, For what? Jamal Williams. Jamal Williams, Jamal Williams is nice, but he ain't no main running back no more, I don't think. Nah, I don't think he was the answer to the line. I literally think, I low key think he was holding back the line last year. From progress, from but, being a No, because he had, um, he had broke. He had broke on um, Barry Sanders' record. Yeah, like most touchdowns, I think, in the seats for the for a Lions were in the back. Yeah, still but though, but Titans had a good team touchdown. Uh, I don't know how many yards he had. The Titans, the, the Titans though, they still got a good, solid defense. It ain't too crazy, but it's all right. They still got the monster behind. They, they still got the monster it. behind the backfield, so anything is possible. Say the offense. Yeah, I said they still have the monster of oh, yeah. in the backfield. So yeah, they, yeah, like the they have they don't have a human being in the backfield. Um yeah, my boy's an alien. And they have they got D Hop you know, D Hop you know, if he if he's all these young corners look come on now all these young corners in the league, bro, that he's getting old, they're gonna lock him, bro. I'm sorry. But think about it, even if he can oh, here's the thing, they still got Traylon Burks. He will be playing wide receiver yeah, too now, so that means you have like better matchups now to go against so it'll be Look, easy for him a little bit. If D Hop stays fully healthy this year, I can see yeah. him at least with thirteen hundred yards. Well, who's starting this year? At least Tannehill. Oh, Tannehill like bad. Bro. Tannehill, I can see just, if Tannehill he just, stay healthy. He if Tannehill stay healthy, not I can bad, see but he just, Tannehill not the answer no if more. If Tannehill, stay, yeah, yeah, but if he can stay healthy and do on, and do his play. But I no, think he'll do at least thirty eight hundred yards. Nobody, but, yeah, it's about time for him to move on, though. Like Malik Willis is yeah, there. Yeah, it's about like, time for him to move on. 
Will Levis, yeah, Will Levis, him Malik Willis. Yeah, Will Levis. It's, like it's, it's time for the young QBs. Yeah, it's time, it's time, time for the young QBs, huh? I think that's it. Like he's the third going. oldest no. quarter. He's the third oldest quarterback yeah. in the league. If he struggle a little yeah. bit this season, they he don't get benched. I think I see that happening too. Yes, yes. But uh, I, I don't even know where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to Titans. I don't know. I'm gonna go to Titans. I'm gonna go to Titans. I guess I got Titans. I, got Titans. I just lost the schedule. Hold up. All right. Oh, we got dang. Oh, Raiders and Broncos. Ah, I got the Raiders. I ain't gonna lie. We, Broncos. Uh, Russ Wash. Russ Wash. I got the Raiders. Broncos country. Let's ride, baby. Let's go. The only reason I'm gonna say the Broncos is I, I can't see Jimmy Garoppolo doing good with Josh McDaniels. Like, <laughs> a coach who. Wait. I forgot Raider. I forgot he got Devontae Adams. So he still should be good. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to Broncos, but dang, Rick. If the Brown Raiders do bad, he's watch Devontae Adams request a trade immediately, Bo. You're not Raiders. <laughs> That's it. The Raiders. He'll request a trade immediately. Yeah. But I'm going to Raiders. I got Raiders. Broncos. You know I don't like you. Are you going to Raiders? Oh, uh, where are you going to Raiders? You know why I said you should know why I don't like the Broncos. But anyway, but I'm just gonna go with the Raiders because like you got a you got Jimmy G, Devontae, Hunter Renfro. They have a decent O line. Actually, you know what? I got I'm going Raiders because I need I got Devontae in my fantasy, so I need him to go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, bro. Uh I'm gonna go to yeah, I'm gonna go to Bri, right? I'm gonna go to Broncos right now. I don't know. It's tough. I'm gonna go to Broncos. It's tough either yeah, way. Both tough. of these teams ain't necessarily doing all that good right now. That's what we yoker. We're not gonna have like that though. Oh yeah, I'm about to say. Uh next you got the Eagles and the Patriots. Eagles, Eagles. there's no question. There's no there, no discussion I'm about that. <laughs> Death Dogs. I'm going with the Philly Delphia Bulldogs. Yeah, I gotta go to, yeah, that's my that's my lock of the week. I ain't know the Eagles and Patriots. I got the Philadelphia Bulldogs. Yep. Because let's look at let's face it, look at the Patriots offense, bro. They ain't really got no receivers who I look at and say, and they say boy, man, they say Juju Smith shoots your knee might yeah, his blow knee, up or something. His knee messed up. Yes. So who else? They got he's not Parker. not content. He's out first game. This look, they got Devontae Parker who ain't been this who ain't been the same since he left Miami. Who else? They still got Hunter Henry, I think. He all right, too. They got Ramon Gray Stevenson at running back. They all line all right. But then they quarterback. I don't even know what the deal is today because. And they got Josh Jacobs. Josh, Jay- Josh Jacobs. You know my bow. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> but I want to know how they quarterback, the quarterback thing go this season. Matt and Jones do bad this season. I can't see Bill Belichick keeping him again this season. I ain't no I way. Can't. A dude who won six rings with a dude who won six rings with Tom Brady cannot keep messing this season if he do good. If he don't do yeah. good. If I'm not mistaken, did they cut Malik Cunningham? Malik Cunningham? I'm surprised they cut him, bro. Because he can use he can yeah, he use him in the cup. And he yeah, can right. be a good quarterback. Like, quarterback can receive like, like certain yeah. situations. But, you know, but I got always, Eagles because you know. Yeah, I got Eagles easily. Yeah, there's no, there's no right, discussion. Uh, about that. That's a cheat code thing. This next one might be another easy one: the Rams and the Seahawks. I got Seahawks. the Seahawks. I got to see it. The Rams just. <laughs> nah, I officially got the Seahawks. Not because Cooper Cup not playing week one. Cooper Cup ain't playing. Yeah, Cooper is not playing. So basically, they main wide out. I think will be. Let me make sure. I think it's gonna Man, be Van Jefferson. Van Jefferson, I think. Let me make sure I got that right, though. But they still got rent. They got Van Jefferson, Tyler Higby. Who else? Tutu Atwell. Tutu Atwell short, though. But he's, he's, fast, he's nice, though. though. Demarcus Rob. They got Demarcus Robinson. I didn't even knew that. Like I said, I'm going to rent. I'm going to Seahawks. I'm going to Seahawks. Like, yeah, this Rams has got too many problems. Too many problems. 
And the Seahawks yeah. got a lot of problems, and not a, in a good way, though. The only thing I worry about with the Seahawks is Geno Smith going to be able to do what he did last season. What y'all think? Better do better. Yeah. I can too, with, too, many receivers, too many receiver weapons for the Seahawks, to, for the Rams to have. Now, they defense line. They defense line ain't that good either. They defense line ain't good though. Like they got a good secondary, but they defense line is like, yeah. yeah. I'm trying to figure. Out, I don't know why they didn't bring back Shelby Harris. He was good. Now he on the Browns, and they go be they D line even better. But yeah, we go to Seahawks. Oh crap, missed. Here's in Dolphins, like I guess today. Dolphinies. Dolphins. I got the Dolphins. Go to- I'm going to Dolphins, too. I can't bet against Tyreek Hill and then Jalen Waddle and then a healthy two or two. The only reason I – only way I see the Dolphins struggling in this game is if they corner start struggling because Jalen Ramsey ain't playing. They got a good undrafted corner, so they might be okay. But the Chargers, I forgot about their receiving core, too. Dang, they got Mike Williams now. They got Quentin oh, Johnson. Mike Allen. They play in jump. One they do, the dude they just added from TCU. Yep. So they got a, they really got a good receiving core. Mm-hmm. And then they got Austin Eckler, who they were using the receiving game. Justin yeah, Herbert yeah, yeah, should yeah, be yeah. able to get an MVP case. Herbert should be able to get an MVP case this year. Should. But Herbert going to be Herbert. <laughs> we don't know what Justin Herbert we're going to get. He got to do. He got to right. do good. If he do bad, if the charge do bad, he's Brandon Stanley got to go. I ain't even going to lie. He holding, he holding him back, too, in a way. Cause they could have made the playoffs two seasons ago, but they, they wanted to do dumb stuff, and that's why they got eliminated. Oh, what about say Packers and the Bears? I Bears. got the Packers. Packers. Yeah. The only reason you go with the Bears is just it feels like your fantasy. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, yeah the Packers. I might change my bit later on if. What's his name now playing? Christian Watson, Romeo Dobbs, because that's like half of the receiving core. But, yeah, Packers should be able to get this one. It's going to be close, though. Division games, like I said, always close because the Packers still got a solid deal. They still got Jair. Eric Stokes going to come back healthy. So, yeah, they, they, it's just going to be close. But I'm going to go to Packers. Jordan Love, he got to prove something this season. He's going to lose his job. Then they get him on a one-year deal. All right. Now we get to my favorite game. Cowboys and dang Giants. I got the okay. Cowboys. Going against my I'm not going against my Giants, so you already know who I'm going. We come in, we're gonna come to win it all this season. We're gonna win the division. We're gonna beat the Eagles. And we're going to the Super Bowl. Oh yeah, in your dreams, buddy. I'm I'm so serious. Bruh, we're stopping us. We're stopping us. Eagles. Philadelphia Bulldogs. The Eagles the only team stopping this. I'm not, I'm not going to sit and pretend like the Cowboys terrorizing. Okay, I'm not going to sit here and lie and say they ain't either. But the cow, we all, yeah, we D-line everybody still knows, good. the world knows that the Cowboys are probably like one of the best regular season teams we ever seen. Word. Yeah. Why when, why, when playoffs, they fold like they fold like a lawn chair. You feel me? Yeah, they do the dumbest stuff in the playoffs. Like, when they lost against the 49ers, Dak Prince got ran and did a QB draw up the middle, and they had to run back and snap it. I'm not going to lie, the- that referee, that referee, um, that referee did it on purpose. Well, he was yeah, tripping. Like, and then the 40, I, mean, and either, they, I mean, either way, they wasn't going to get the ball downfield in that time anyway. You're right, but they wasn't going to score. The game last yeah. year, they made Zeke the center and tried to snap it up straight, straight to Dak, thinking that was going to work too. And he got popped. Kayvon Turpin. But the Giants, they got to prove something. They got to, they got to make something happen this year with their D-line. They got Kayvon right. Thibodeau on their D-line. Aziz Ojolari, Leonard Williams, Dexter Lawrence, and Sean Robinson. They defense got top 10 potential. Because Wing Martin, they're always going to do is blitz Dak Prescott the whole time, try to get a sack on him. But Dak Prescott, I don't know, he's going to probably work against that blitz. So that's what I fear about. But I'm going to Giants. But That's a giant. Dale Jones got to, Dale Jones got to make some effort this year too. You got to get at least twenty five touchdowns. You can't have no fifteen, no no fourteen, no ten touchdowns. You got to have 
at least 25, no more than, no less than that. To prove you that guy, bro. I can't do that no more. I can't, I can't settle for less. What about you? What y'all think? I got the Giants. I got I the Cowboys. Got the Giants, too. All right. Now we get back to it. The Bills versus the Jets. Oh, hell versus the Jets. That's, that's a tough one, but I gotta go to Jets, man. I'm gonna go to Bills. Josh Allen's too careless with the ball for me. I mean, I don't know, bro. Aaron Rodgers was kind of careless last season too, so but you never yeah, know. But he was, Rodgers always been known for his accuracy. A Rod always exactly. been known for his accuracy, so you can't really. He still almost really took them to the playoffs. Today. If you, I ain't gonna lie. If you would have still had Devontae Adams, he probably still would have made the playoffs. Yeah, of course. Or if he had any like. Other receiver like that day because Christian Watts didn't break out until like week seven, something like that. That's when he started the ball. And so, yeah, but him and him and Devontae would be a nasty duo. They're gonna, they're gonna be some good matchups. Stephon Diggs and South Garden, they'll be talking, they're gonna be talking all kinds of junk. But let's hope he, Stephon Diggs don't do he like, like he did Jalen Ramsey week one. Yeah, Last year, that was that was crazy. Yeah, too crazy, but um, he's not letting that happen. Garrett Wilson wow. versus Davies White. That's going to be another good matchup. Yeah. But I'm going to go, yeah. I'm gonna go, I got the Bills. Yeah. I think that's every game, bro. So, what team do I think will be getting, will, could possibly get an upset that's playing each other? I think Ooh. it's easy to Lions, though. Oh, yeah, I thought so. I think they are. Yeah. yeah. Hey, you see, oh. either the Lions going to manage to get an upset or the Giants, like, easily. Yeah. Maybe that's me being biased, but I don't know. Yeah. I think we got every game, bro. Dang, this mm. gonna be a lot of audio, but uh, I think we got everything, bro. So, yeah, we gonna wrap it up here. Got anything else y'all want to say? Appreciate for having us on. Keep pounding. Say, keep for the pounding. shoe, baby. For the shoe, baby. We do it for the shoe, baby. Keep pounding. Big blue, bro. Big blue. But nah, we appreciate what he's like. What what um B say? We appreciate. Yeah. All right, boy, y'all boys, we're gonna wrap it up here. If y'all still right. watching, if y'all somehow made it to the end of this long video, make sure you hit that subscribe button, tap that bell icon, follow on my social media. You can find that down below in the description. Uh, if they want me to, I'll leave they, they, they social in the description. If y'all want to do that, y'all ain't really got to. Y'all let me know if y'all want to do that. But uh, we're gonna wrap it up here. Thank y'all boys for watching. And I don't know, we might be back week two. It depends, it depends. And I'll see y'all boys in the next video. Man's gonna fuck it, 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 man's got 50 likes, then Randolph trying to blast off, he wasn't in the face. In my way, for a nigga better go pray. I'ma send Kilgore State. Walking down to the nigga, a with a micro drink. The drop, we score, nigga, no one play.